topic is uh, related to the wave. The slinky spring can be used to demonstrate the number of uh, properties of the wave. The diagram shows a wave being produced in a slinky spring when the hand oscillate from left to right. So hand is oscillating from left to right. As a result, it produces a wave. Describe the wave that are being demonstrated in the diagram. So first thing, because you can see the direction of a vibration and direction in which the energy transfer are parallel. So what kind of wave is this? The wave which is produced is a longitudinal wave. That is first thing. So what the wave we are observing is a longitudinal wave. And whenever longitudinal wave is there, it is produced by like, or it propagate or travel in the manner of a compression and rarefaction. And the why it is a longitudinal because the particles are vibrating parallel to direction of the wave. So particles vibrate. Parallel to direction of wave. And then produce compression and rarefaction. There are compressions and rare factions are there. And uh, in, you can explain the wavelength, uh, the compression and rare faction. Compression means region of high pressure. Whereas for rare faction, we can mention region of low pressure. And the distance between the two successive crest, sorry, two successive compressions and two success or two successive rarefaction. That is no so like one compression to another compression, the distance between them is equals to the wavelength, which is denoted by lambda. Okay. 